Faye Williams made the call to WGST News Radio last night during a live interview with Dr. Joseph Lowry, president of the Southern Christian Leadership Conference. We've got some high officials that are doing a lot of cover-ups, and we are going to expose a lot of it tomorrow morning. But when tomorrow came, a very subdued Homer Williams and his attorney, Lynn Watley, had little to say. And, uh, it is our conclusion at this time that no statements will be made. I think that's conspiracy. Um, I definitely feel that uh, you have the wrong person. I put it that way. And I'll say again that Wayne is being used as a scapegoat. Williams said the reason he and his wife wanted to hold a press conference today in the first place was to refute statements made recently by Mayor Young. But again, he backed off. The statement that uh, Anna Young made upset me quite a bit. I think Mr. Biden responded to that. That's what we had planned to respond to. Which statement was that in particular? Well, uh, I'm not able to recall the specific. I don't want to quote unless I get it accurately. Williams did say he was angry with Public Safety Commissioner Lee Brown for announcing earlier this week that Wayne Williams has been linked to 23 cases on the task force list. And Attorney Watley says he is considering suing a psychologist who once worked with the defense team for slander for telling a newspaper reporter Wayne is capable of committing a string of murders. Watley then revealed that he will soon file petitions with the court asking that Wayne Williams be classified as an indigent to help pay for his appeal, even though Judge Clarence Cooper once turned down a similar request by the defense for money because it was found at the time that Williams was not indigent. It was also revealed today that the Williams have filed a $70,000 claim with the city of Atlanta for damage done to their home when the task force searched there last summer. Attorney Lynn Watley says representatives from the city attorney's office have agreed to meet with him as soon as possible in hopes of settling that claim out of court. B.B. Emmerman, Action News.